all businesses registered here in Tampa to learn about what the convention is all about uh, and to learn how we're going to plug them in to a process so that they can succeed and get business here in the local Tampa Bay area. Uh, the convention, as you all know, is, is one of the largest media events in the world. It's second only to the Olympic Games in terms of the amount of media personnel that show up. The economic impact for the convention in direct spending is roughly $175 million to $200 million hard dollars. Uh, when you take into account the multiplier effect, um, the, the economic impact can approach a half a billion dollars. Uh, this will be the largest event that's ever been held in the Tampa Bay area and one of the largest events that will ever be held in the state of Florida. Uh, so with Matt Becker, our Chief Operating Officer, Hector Beretta, the former Administrator for the U.S. Small Business Administration and current Chairman of the Latino Coalition, We've put together a phenomenal team to really showcase our local business and match them up with the opportunities that exist for this convention. Uh, and with that, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll let Mr. Bretto say a few words. Thank you, Ken and Matt. I'm very excited about being here. Uh, this is an exciting opportunity, and I want to commend Ken and his team uh, for their leadership. Uh, you know, it's amazing that this is the first time that we're doing something like this, especially at a, at a convention like this one. But, um, you know, it's a, it's a great achievement, and I know that we're going to be able to generate a lot of positive results. You know, one thing that I learned when I was the administrator of the Small Business Administration is that small business needs the same thing that big business needs. They need more business. And if you can help them get more business, they can take care of a lot of those other issues themselves. During this economic downturn, small businesses have been some of the companies that have been affected the most. So what we're doing here today is what I kind of consider surrounding small business with the tools that they need to succeed. So we'll be talking a lot about how this program works. We'll talk about some of the contracting opportunities that are coming up. We'll give them some advice on how they should prepare themselves for some of the upcoming matches that we'll be doing when we come back here in, a, in, a, in about a month. And, um, and so there's going to be a lot of uh, you know, sharing, a lot of give and take, and I know that we're going to have a very productive day. Again, I'm very excited about being here as the former administrator of the SBA and currently the chairman of the Latino Coalition. This is work that we're involved with every single day. And if small business, those 27 million small businesses, are the engine of America, then the work that we're doing today is going to be very important for them, not only now, but in the future. So thanks again for the opportunity to be here, and I know we're going to have a great day. I would say the expectation for today's event or what we're trying to do is set the expectations in the small business community for what to expect out of this program. The, the goal for today is to walk them through the process on how they register. Uh, once they've gone through the registration process, we want to do, as the administrator had said, give them the tools to succeed. We want to show them and, and give them advice and, and work with them to promote them, to market them, and to showcase this small business community to the world. And with the convention here and with the platform we have from the host committee that Ken and I have, we want to do everything we can to promote the small business community uh, because we think it's the right thing to do. Okay.